What's poppin' y'all? Welcome back to another reaction video. So we are about to hop into another video by Wanzi Entertainment. This one is My Friend Disappeared from the Deep Web. So without further ado, guys, we're just gonna hop straight into this video. So let's go. It's about when I was 21. I had a friend named Steven. He was very nice, but had a really bad complex on his face. He had serious skin problems, and it was hard to meet people. Another friend around him always made fun Aww. of his face. So from some point on, he didn't go out of the house because he became a social misfit. He has always been stuck at home, like a ghost. I was his only friend. It's not good. You gotta get One some day, when I went to his house to see him, I could see that he was getting darker and worse. All kinds of caffeine drinks were piled up on his desk, and his appearance was getting worse. There's something he's into these days, and it's the deep web. I think he enjoyed watching all the stimulating things on the deep web and feeling out of touch with the world. Mm. In the deep web's Ooh. world, you could see the things which don't happen in the real world. I feel like he wanted to escape reality like that. Worried, I told him to quit, but he didn't listen. One day, while I was playing at his house, he found some kind of terrible sight on the deep web. And I could see lots of pictures of many people's skins and bones being separated. I was disgusted right them. away, but my friend Steven started to feel interest in. Is this all real? I told him to stop watching, but he kept digging the site. Start your new life. We'll make you have a new face. It was written in red letters like this. I think it was talking about taking off the skin of someone else's face and transplanting it. So it's mm. kind of illegal plastic surgery. Does this make any sense? It's nonsense. I'm sure it's a fake site that someone just made to make fun of others. However, Steven sent an email there, and a few days later, he disappeared. And he still hasn't shown up so far. No one has ever seen him, including his family. But you know what? When I looked out the window from my house sometimes, there was a man looking at my house from afar. He was very handsome. <gasps> He would look at my house for a while as if he were thinking That's about something him. and then disappeared. At first, I thought he was just confused about the address or had something to do around here. One day, something came to my memory suddenly. Was that Stephen? Maybe he showed up with his new face <gasps> and came to see me. Of course, I still miss him. Oh my I God, look, 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 look at his eyes. That's him. That's a mask. Bro, look at his eyes. He's alive somewhere. Ew. So he went and got the leather face. That is so creepy. I, I literally thought, I thought how the story was gonna go. I thought that the friend the one that was like, you know, addicted to the deep web. I thought that he was gonna get his friend. I thought he was gonna like somehow kidnap his friend and drag him to the illegal surgeon and have his face cut off because maybe he felt like maybe jealous of his friend or maybe he thought his friend was attractive and he wanted to look like him. I thought that's what he was gonna do. I thought that's how the story was gonna go, but oh that is very very creepy like i love these dark web well not really because they get sometimes they go a little too far and it's just it, it, i can't but i like some of these dark web videos because they're just so intriguing but yeah y'all that was my reaction to this video if you guys enjoyed my reaction please make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and i will see you in my next reaction video bye